Hello, I'm Tony Baca, Senior Vice President of Safety at Berglund Construction Company. This week's Safety Steps Toolbox Talk is on step ladders and extension ladders. And the reason I want to do a safety topic video on this this week is because we do site safety inspections and good catches on our projects on a weekly basis and we have a trend that's been performed as of late on multiple job sites and that's just simply using these wrong. Two seasons back we hired a tradesperson regionally in another state that was standing on top of this. He walked up this ladder all the way to the top and was standing on the top of this. And it says right here, all the rules and regs of what not to do. A photo of him was taken and we got cited by the Occupational Safety and Health Administration for that individual using a step ladder wrong. That individual's response was, nobody ever taught me on how to use a step ladder. All the rules and regs of a step ladder are right here. They're right there on, you, on every single ladder. All you got to do is look at them. One of them says, you can't use a step ladder in a closed fashion like this. Because when you egress up that step ladder, she may slip out from underneath you and you fall on your face. Additionally, when you are using a ladder out in the field, inspect it before each use, making sure it's got these nice feet on the bottom for slip resistance. Do you know that one out of one out of every five falls in our country is off of ladders. These have a tendency of slipping, tipping, because we go up these things, we lose our two points of contact, and this son of a gun, you know, we're reaching this way, and we're reaching this way, and she tips over on us. If we can entertain using bakers and scissors lifts, they're much better than ladders, because a lot of General contractors have no ladder policies on their job sites because so many injuries occur with these. And then when using a step ladder and coming down off of it, if there's debris in the way, this is ankle breakers right here. So wherever you're setting up a ladder, your housekeeping should be fairly clean. Let's try and stop the non-compliances on our job sites with our subcontractors. They're working on these things backwards. They're standing on this rung right here that says, warning, don't step up this high or even this high. It's all there for us, but yet week after week after week as I review the site safety inspection sheets, our subcontractors are primarily using these in a very dangerous fashion. Somebody's gonna end up getting hurt. Falling off a step ladder backwards, you can hit your head, you can break your back, break a wrist. Wouldn't be a bad idea. If you've got a step ladder handy on your job sites to have your tradespeople gather around and just simply go through these seven or eight rules and regs that OSHA states and the manufacturer state are proper use and improper use. Let's have a safe day. Let's have a safe week. Thank you.